the last uh, piece of anatomy that we're going to talk about uh, are the kidneys. Uh, again, these are pork or uh, pig parts, but they are very similar to what uh, human parts look like. That's why I've used those for these demonstrations. I bet you can guess what these are because these are kidneys. That's where when you think about kidney beans or that they're in the shape of nice little beans, uh, that's why we uh, have kidney beans named that is because they're in the shape of, of what your kidneys are. The kidneys remove or filter waste. You've noticed that several of the things that we've talked about are talking about getting rid of all of that junk that we sometimes put into our body that we shouldn't. But it removes or filters waste. It also causes the um, coloring that is in your urine. Uh, if you uh, uh, are producing a very dark colored urine, you're drinking too, too little liquid. The more liquid you drink, the lighter color your urine is and the more healthy that is for your body to, uh, to have a lighter color urine. If, you're not, if your urine is too dark, obviously you are not um, drinking enough liquid because it can't filter enough of your liquid through to be able to, to make your body uh, healthier. Uh, it also has, uh, your urine also uh, is, uh, has nitrogen in it. Uh, which has that ammonia smell when you urinate. And what it's doing is it's breaking down the protein of things that you're eating and it's being filtered through the kidneys. Your kidneys uh, help regulate your blood pressure. Obviously that's a, a big deal. Lots of people suffer with high blood pressure or low blood pressure, uh, mainly high blood pressure, but uh, that's uh, filtered or regulated by the kidneys. It deals with your fluid level. Uh, it even regulates your body temperature somewhat. Uh, it removes toxin. Uh, if you uh, drink too much of stuff that you shouldn't be drinking, like if you drink a six pack of beer, it has to work overly hard and that's not a good plan. So be thinking about what you put into your body and how it's gonna get out. Uh, it also retains fluid somewhat. Uh, your kidneys uh, are emptied by the, by the urethra and I'm not sure I can show you that. I don't think it's visible in these little fellas. I don't know whether you can see that little hole right there or not, but that's the urethra. Uh, and it uh, filters that into the bladder. And then the little bladder uh, empties into the urethra. Uh, in terms of diseases, you can have kidney stones, which are very, very painful if you've heard people that talk about how bad kidney stones are. Um, diabetes is a really hard thing on your kidneys. Uh, it can deteriorate your kidneys, uh, making you end up on uh, dialysis because your kidneys are not functioning. Uh, high blood pressure is hard on your kidneys as well. And as I mentioned, dialysis is a, a man-made version of how to filter the, the uh, uh, problems or the filters the waste uh, that come through your body. If your kidneys are not functioning, then you have to go on to dialysis to be able to filter all of that stuff. So two kidneys, obviously you can live without both of them. You can live with one kidney, uh, but you do need uh, a functioning kidney. Otherwise you would have to have uh, dialysis of some form. So the kidneys are just what they look like. They're cute little kidney beans.